Hello, friends. Those of you who don't believe that there are tigers with manes or striped lions are deeply mistaken. Big cat hybrids can be seen in zoos, and lovers of exotic pets often have crossbreeds of domestic cats and their wild relatives at home. In nature, however, hybrids of two species are extremely rare. While crossbreedings in captivity don't usually happen on purpose, but due to an oversight of the caretakers. Today's video will show you what will happen if you crossbreed a jaguar, a puma, a lion, a leopard, and a tiger. Enjoy! The Liger A Liger or Leger is a hybrid between a male lion and a female tiger that looks like a giant lion with blurred stripes. Its size and appearance resemble the cave lion and its cousin, the American lion, that went extinct in the Pleistocene epoch. Ligers are the largest cats in the world today. The largest liger is Hercules from Jungle Island, an interactive theme park. Male ligers, with rare exceptions, have almost no mane and, unlike lions, they can and love to swim. Other distinctive features of ligers is that the female ligers can give birth to offspring, which is unusual. The length of the liger can reach 4 to 5 meters or even more, and its weight exceeds 300 kilograms. This is a third more than that of a large lion. The largest living liger, Hercules, weighs 418 kilograms, which equals to 100 domestic cats or two large lions, or five or six people the carrying capacity of a standard elevator. Hercules can eat 45 kilograms of food in one sitting and develops a speed of 80 kilometers an hour faster than you can count to 10. In 1973, the Guinness Book of Records recorded a 798 kilogram liger living in Bloemfontein Zoo in South Africa. The Valley of the King's Animal Sanctuary in Wisconsin, USA was home to a 550 kilogram liger named Nook, who died in 2007 at the age of 21 years. The Tiglon A Tiglon or Tigon is a hybrid of a male tiger and a female lion. Tigons aren't currently as common as their opposite ligers. Although in the late 19th to early 20th centuries, it was the opposite. Tigons never occur in nature since tigers and lions have different habitats. Tigers live in Asia, while lions live in some regions of South and Central Africa. Ligers are the largest felines in the world, while tigons, on the contrary, are usually smaller than their parents and weigh less than 150 kilograms. Tigons are less common than ligers. Tigons combine the characteristics of both parents. They can have the mother's spots, the lion's genes are responsible for the spots as their cubs are born spotted, and the father's stripes. The tigon's mane, if they do have it, will always be shorter than that of a lion. Male tigons are always sterile, while females are fertile. They can mate with both lions and tigers, thus creating new hybrids with the predominance of either lion or tiger blood. These cubs are always larger than their parents. They have the characteristics of both parents. A dark color, a red mane, short or less dense, pale stripes, a light muzzle. Many male hybrids have no mane. China has become the world leader in the number of tigons living there. Twelve surviving ligers have been bred in five years in the province of Hainan only. The Leguar A Leguar or Jagulep is a hybrid of a jaguar and a leopard. The terms are often used interchangeably, regardless of which animal was the sire. The term Lepjag can also be used. These hybrids don't exist in nature, 
since the parental species live on different continents. The jaguar is native to Central and South America, and the leopard, Panthera pardus, has historically lived in a wide area, including Southwest Asia, Transcaucasia, Pakistan, India, China, Indonesia, Java, Zanzibar, and Sri Lanka. Today, the leopard has become extinct in a number of territories and mostly lives in Africa. Leguars look more stocky than a leopard and have a golden red coat with large, unequal spots that cover the whole body, forming a circular pattern around the legs and the head. The coat is lighter on the underbelly and between the legs. The Lipard A Lipard or Liard is a hybrid of a male lion and a female leopard, a reverse hybrid of the Leopon. They retain the appearance of a lion, looking like a smaller copy. Its head is smaller and the body is covered with brownish spots. The head resembles that of a lion. The tail has a tassel of fur, like a lion's, while the rest of the body resembles a leopard. Lipards are larger than leopards in size, but smaller than lions. The Puma Pard A Puma Pard resulted from crossbreeding a male Puma and a female Leopard. Hybrids of these types of cats were first born in the late 1890s in Chicago. They had a long body like a Puma with short legs. It turned out later that Puma Pards can be of various colors. Sandy, reddish or grayish brown, chestnut with bright spots. These hybrids didn't live to maturity. Jaglion Jaglion or Jaguan is a hybrid of a male jaguar and a female lion. Jaglion is usually black in color. Its anatomy is similar to that of the African lion. Males have a short, dense and black mane. Their face looks swollen and almost gray in color. Sometimes the color is reddish brown or dark red. An effigy of such a jaglion is kept in the Natural History Museum at Tring, England. It has a red lion-like color and a small jaguar build. It has dark spots on its chest like a jaguar, only less noticeable. On April 9, 2006, two jaglions were born in the Canadian Bear Creek Exotic Wildlife Sanctuary in Ontario, north of Toronto. The female was named Jazara and the male, Tsunami. They were born as a result of an unintentional mating between a black jaguar named Diablo and a tame lioness, Lola. Tsunami looks like a spotted lion, and Jazara is black in color since she inherited the dominant jaguar gene. And here's what you get by crossbreeding an ocelot and a puma. Scientists don't encourage such experiments and those zoos that create artificial hybrids to attract visitors get criticized. Same goes for the circusers. Animals should be healthy and their offspring should have the right to reproduce and not to be sterile. Moreover, artificially erasing the boundaries between species means interfering with the natural course of evolution. Well, that's all, friends. If you like this video as well as the hybrids featured in it, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.